How would you feel if your roommate came home and released 250 bugs into your living room? Hi, I'm Holly from The Primal Desire, and I'm here today to talk to you about ladybugs, what they eat, and how to care for them in this video. We have a number of house plants, like our favorite here, Fern. We were having an issue with spider mites. Um, somebody got spider mites, or one of the plants I brought home new had spider mites. Somebody. Somebody. <laughs> uh, and it's been a, an ongoing struggle, and I, I feel like we got it under control and then a couple weeks would go by and then there would be more you know, plants with um, brown spots in the leaves and you could tell something was eating them. This has a has been wiped with neem oil and this one has not. So while the neem oil makes it nice and shiny, it also um, is a natural insecticide to kill spider mites, the, the oily surface, along with a little bit of dish soap and water. I was spraying underneath the leaves and wiping the leaves down, but I still couldn't seem to get the spider mites under control. So I did a little bit of research and discovered that ladybugs eat not only aphids, but spider mites. Here's the solution to our problem. I stop at the local plant store and get a package of ladybugs to bring home and release into our living room plants. Now I did check with Raj before I did this. Um, did you? I did, yeah. <laughs> I said, hey, how would you feel about new roommates? I think I'm gonna buy some ladybugs. And he, I don't know if he wasn't paying attention to me, which happens fairly regularly. <laughs> or he didn't hear me, or he just nodded so that I would stop talking to him. But he nodded and I went and bought 500 ladybugs. They came in a package of 250. Uh, I released one package outdoors and one package in our living room. So <laughs> I wasn't sure if I was an evil genius or a complete mad woman. Maybe a little bit of both. And it's still to be determined, really. Um, so we, I released all of these ladybugs and then I was concerned that there wouldn't be enough spider mites for them to eat. So what do ladybugs eat other than spider mites and aphids? I'm not gonna go buy aphids and then release those into the thing. Although I did consider it for a moment. So then I started doing some research, due diligence, after I'd already released these ladybugs. Did you know that a ladybug can live as long as two to three years? No, me neither. Uh, a swarm is called a loveliness. So those big swarms of ladybugs, they're cold blooded. So they actually are huddling together for heat. They're cuddling. That is lovely. Cuddling is lovely. There's four stages of a ladybug's life. They start as an egg. They move to a larva, a pupae, and then they become ladybugs. The egg stage is four to 10 days, depending on the temperature. They spend 30 days as larva, and only half of the larva are, um, will hatch out of the eggs. The rest of the eggs are left as a food source for the larva. And they look like little mini alligators. They're yellow and black. Uh, and they've got like alligator type mouths, which is interesting. Uh, I mean, allegedly, I haven't seen one yet. Uh, the pupa stage is 15 days and then they come out uh, and the redness develops as a defense mechanism to signify that they don't taste very good to birds. Birds don't like the color red. My mom has a pet chicken and whenever I would paint my toenails red, she would come over and peck at my toenails. She, it was like danger. Males are typically smaller than female ladybugs. And they can, but they don't usually bite humans. 
uh, they will secrete a little uh, sort of yellow stain. It's a toxic, um, it's like a toxic secretion that makes them taste terrible. They also will play dead. So if you have a ladybug and it's, you know, got its feet up, it might not be dead. It could be just playing dead. They're quite good actors. There's some ladybugs, uh, a specific harlot ladybug that actually carries and transmits an STI, a little ladybug bacteria for those wild ladybug orgies. And those ladybugs, they like to party. I've seen a couple of them doing up and down, chasing one another on the pineapple plant. And a couple of them like to live on the disco ball. Because they're cold blooded, they're most active in the heat of the day between 2 and 4 p.m. Uh, then they move around. The rest of the time they seem to just kind of hunker down. Um, and on especially cold days, uh, we've had a really cold summer so far, they just bunch together, trying to keep warm. Wait, that two to four thing, that's our own observation, right? Right, yeah. yeah. Yeah, the two to four is our own observation for the ladybugs in our living room. Um, I, it, funny enough, I searched, but I couldn't find the daily habits of ladybugs so or the psychology of ladybugs. Watch um, for those to come. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll start studying them intently. Uh, so what do ladybugs eat? They love to eat aphids. Some varieties are only herbivores, but most are voracious carnivores. And they're cannibalists. They'll eat one another. They can eat as many as 5,000 aphids in a lifetime. So if you have a small aphid problem, you only need a couple ladybugs. They will make that go away quick. I was concerned that we wouldn't have enough food for them, so I soaked some raisins, and I might have gotten a little carried away, but I don't know how much ladybugs eat. They eat uh, aphids, spider mites, insect eggs, raisins, and allegedly lettuce or honey, um, but I don't think they've had any of the raisins. I mean, I'm not sure, but it doesn't look like it. That's the extent of the research I've done so far. The 250 ladybugs that we released in our living room, one I released outside, which a spider quite promptly ate, um, and two have died that we know of so far, but there doesn't seem to be as many of them around, so I'm not sure where they've gone. Do you have any tips about ladybugs? We'll see. Put them in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share, smash that bell button. Subscribe to follow this story. Oh, that's a mosquito on the outside. Uh, yeah, subscribe to follow this story. Smash that bell button to get all the ladybug updates. Like, share, and follow. Ladybug Trail.